and I have Coach Steve Sumaro with us from the Carlton Ravens. First year coach with the Ravens as they well reinvent themselves and rejoin CIS football. And Coach, you, uh, it's an interesting take you may have on this tournament having been the head coach out at St. Mary's and having played some football out in eastern Canada and now familiarizing yourself more with, say, central Canada. Um, what do you look for as a coach on the recruiting side coming to a tournament like this? Well, for us, with uh, starting up, we're looking for everybody. <laughs> you know, that's our first thing. Uh, no, the thing that we're looking for mostly is, you know, what kind of talent the kid has, uh, size, potential. You know, a lot of these guys are in grade 10 and 11, and uh, which kind of fits in our wheelhouse for the 2013 season. So, you know, our, our job right now is to evaluate, kind of get a chance to meet the kid, sort of get a bit of his personality as well as his skill set. And, and a lot of the times, if they're from out of province, if they're prepared to, uh, to join us in Ottawa. So that's my uh, great lead into my next question is exactly that. Um, a venue like this, how do you feel it facilitates recruiting? Do you find that these are becoming strong tools in recruiting or are they just kind of, you know, getting legs underneath them, so to speak? No, I think these are fantastic. And I think uh, the more CIS coaches that show up and if, uh, you know, when you look around the stands, there's a lot of recruiters in those stands. And, and I think they, uh, the players start to recognize the value of being in these tournaments. And, and the experience they gain is, is second to none. I mean, you get a chance to play teams across the country, make friends for life, uh, and play football and get a chance to be recruited. I, I think it's fantastic. And having been, I won't say everywhere, but throughout our, this fine country of ours, um, what do you think in terms of the level from province to province? Is, is it continually going up from what you've seen? Absolutely. I, I think it starts at the grassroots too and the coaching that's coming across this country. It's it's phenomenal what these kids are able to do. The offenses and defenses are running. They're so sophisticated considering they've only have a short amount of time normally to get together. It's it's very impressive. No, and last but not least, is there anything in particular? I mean, obviously the style of tournament, you have to be a little cautious. Is there anything that you're really keen on like you want to see out here because you know it's a shortened, uh, we'll call it a shortened season for lack of a better term? Well, yeah, I mean, we're always looking for evaluating the line play. You know, that's you win and lose by your line. And, uh, you know, there's some kids out here that are uh, that can move their feet. And that's the biggest thing that uh, for us, you know, there's some kids that are, you know, six, 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 seven, but they can move. And, uh, you know, that's our that's the thing that we're looking for the most. If we can find those guys that, in this situation, uh, because the talent they're going against is going to force our game to rise for sure. Well, Coach, I very much appreciate your time, and I wish you the best of luck in 2013 because I think it's going to get here sooner than either one of us thinks. <laughs> You're right on that. Uh, we sometimes have some panic moments as it gets closer, but yes, thank you. <laughs> Fair enough. And that was uh, Carlton head coach Steve Samara here at the 2012 Football Canada Cup. And this is Wayne Jacobs for the Sports Streaming Network. Bidding you adieu for now from the 2012 Football Canada Cup.